The march started in front of the Raccoon Street Police Station and ended inside Rogers Stadium. There was music, barbecuing, dominoes and card games. They are also the leaders of every gang in Bali City. We have Majestic Alley and Jungle, we have um, Judge Street, Kong Shelby, Banak Street, PIV, Bakalan, Sunset, Afghanistan, um, Kral Road, Sopal Street, Southside, Jane Osha, and uh, from Baka Farbers Road. So we have representation from, yes, from every, every gang across the city are represented here today. And they made an effort to participate in one of the few steps towards a gang choose because, as some of them explain, they are tired of the gang life. But leaving it all behind is not an easy choice to make. I am with everybody, but I change. I change good well. Is everyone from your era willing to change like how you have? Halloween to make money on my <laughs> side at all. But in terms of the, this attempted pig gang choose, are all of them willing to do so? Well, I'm most excited out here. Yeah, that just shows that everybody wants to change. For how long? I don't know, for how long. <laughs> I know I cool. Let's try to work down in the city and leave it down. I don't lose them, bro. I understand. I'll start work down. Do you think this gang choose one, you know, last long or this peace initiative on last long? Well, I'll start to date more after that song, man. We not choose this. This this other song, this choose we. Big people in the street when I go out positive way forward in the sense that you see the corruption, you see the opportunities and when you try to go for the opportunities all the face of the corruption, you face questions back, you're not good for this, you're not good for that, that's that the reason why we stay up on the side and try to find an opportunity out because you got different breeds at the level of the street, you got man where rob, rape, kill, thief, for we neighborhood could judge for we crew and say they young boy to fight for their life. So they just their life. They don't, burglary is not happening in a free neighborhood. Robbery is not happening in a free neighborhood. No kidnap walk the street and their phone get their quay. So the people they need to open their eyes see that. You know they? In a this life you got yeah, like a code. Can you can't just walk, turn your back and walk. Then they are dead. You have to, continue you have to have a plan out. Uh, we are out. Hey, right now we attention for whole peace as long as the next group the whole peace and everybody the whole peace to peace. You know what I mean? I'm try to find a job and work. So if one gang breaks the peace tonight or tomorrow night, everything go back the same. Yeah, yeah. I going back all the same because nobody will watch. Nobody will watch that happen, you know what I mean? If one shot happen, everybody will make that, you know what I mean? Yeah, no, have to keep it's a peace to peace. That for myself, I change, you know. I, I want to change, I, I encourage everybody around me and uh, for other neighborhoods to change, though. You get the sense what that I want to make you peace. reach that stage there for one change? Because I know I have no kids, man, but at the same time, too, I got family members that could get hurt innocently. You understand where I'm from? You tired of it? Tired yeah, of living? Tired of this, man. Yeah, this long time. But will this gang choose last longer than the previous attempt? Many things that we are doing are things that had been done before, and uh, there are good initiatives. The Black March is a good initiative as well. But what we like about this one is that the participants are only those persons who are affected by the different shootings in the city and uh, it is their, it was their idea, they decided that, we, that they'll have it and again we have representation from every black in Belize city, so including those from that side. They've tried it all and I'm telling you millions of dollars has been invested in this country to cry, curb crime and violence. Um, consultants have been paid hundreds of thousands of dollars to do this job and none has been able to penetrate these guys the way Jawi has done. What is the difference is people go by the book and people read and research different things. What's happening in X country? What's going on in another man's country? Who wrote the last book? Jawi and the difference of what we bring on board is that Jawi has lived this life from the age of nine. My history is kind of deep in, in America with the Bloods. I'm first generation Bloods on the East Coast in Jersey. Um, and I've been through all that comes with the gang life. I've been to jail, I've been to prison. I done beat murder charges, I done beat attempted murder charges. I done buried 36 of my homies. I done been through that come with the gang life. So um, my last legal fight was in 2015. They tried to give me a life sentence and I think that was the time where I really just seen the effect that I was having on my family. 
on my children. And that was really what made me kind of wake up and see that I could use the influence that I had for something good. And from that point, and I started writing books and I started seeing how the books I was writing was influencing the gang members. And from there, I just ran with it. Um, so when you say the influence that I have come out here, I mean, I come out here and I give it to them straight and raw, man. I, I don't I don't sugarcoat nothing for them. I don't, um, my reputation speak for itself. So anything they look up on my name, they're going to see that I'm one of the reputables from America. And a lot of what they claim, it come from where I'm from. Reporting for Love News, Hippolyta Novello.